Hey guys, it's your boy ready for some review action. We have the patch notes here and I'm not actually gonna go too deep into the patch note because you, it's just some just it's just a lot of reading and you can also do that yourself and it's not something to waste 20 minutes or 25 minutes for. So I'm just I just picked up some key points and that I'm gonna talk about in this video and then I have one major issue that people are actually starting to panic about which is the crystal spending for this update which can be easily easily sorted out if you just 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 give me five or ten minutes i will just explain it to you let's go for the characters first so we get professor rack blah 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 uh, he's available from the danger room extreme pack for crystals of course mystique for crystals crystal world character yes and then mr sinister which we thought probably could become a blast villain meta but he is not he just uh, <laughs> he just outshined uh, in this op characters uh, mayhem so he just forgotten so you although you can actually get mr sinister for free from the faction battle after the update and then we got four new uniforms which i'm going to talk about in a bit just give me a few minutes then these characters can be upgraded to level 70 now professor x is level 70 tier 3 character tier 3 skill looks good he has 40 percent of mind resistance down which is pretty nice then ignores ignore dodge for 100 percent and then 80 percent chance to penetrate everything and then we have increased damage dealt damage increase by 20 percent 20 percent for one attack Really? I think that's a typo error. And the 10, 10 seconds invincibility also. Now for the new awakening skill and potential awakening material. Okay. So we got uh, Mystic as a new awakened character. You can just read it out. I'm not gonna go it. It actually re looks really good when he eventually transforms into Magneto. Now take note that the material source of potential awakening has changed and uh, new items has been added. So the location of awakening crystals. So you cannot acquire uh, awakening crystal from World Boss Ultimate anymore. You will have to play sh a squad battle, the new game mode that they introduce to get the awakening crystals to enhance your awaken or to awaken your characters. Now we have here new potential awakening material called mandalay jam fragment has been added which will be used to potentially or uh, which will be used to awaken the potential for characters now the potential awakening materials also have been changed so for now for the current apk we use cosmic cube fragments titan components pack dimension and dimension dust and awakening crystals to awaken a character potential sorry awaken a character like dr octopus after the update it will change to we will need the awaken crystals we will still need the ccf but we will not need the titan component spec and damage and dust dust and apart i mean for those uh, just to compensate for those materials we will be using a new materials called the mandalay jam fragment which will be uh, a re which will be a reward from the new squad battle mode that they actually just introduced it's not uh, nothing it's not much to actually talk about this game mode because it just 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 make points kill the enemies collect the orbs make points and then you will get rewarded uh, in the game mode and now it's the this change actually potential awakening change is actually good because we will need the new materials and the titan component spec one of the most uh, used materials because we need those titan component spec and dimension does to increase character gears from 20 to 25 which is pretty pretty expensive so we get bankrupt on these characters uh, sorry materials so this is really really good for the material itself so we can save more and more and actually we can work out more characters to level gears 25 which is pretty nice squad battle and then sword battle chest we're gonna get some higher scores and the higher the score is 100,000 you get you get a chest 300,000 or plus you get awakening crystals 20 then 800,000 or plus you get mandalay jam fragments 10 now the Mandalay Jam Fragments amount that you get will increase with the League of the Squad Battle from Bronze to Vibranium just like Tamil Battle where crystals go up as you move up the uh, the game mode so that's pretty good and then we have shield academy mission is just uh, nothing nothing important then tutorial renewal some improvements for the new players and then here oh yeah you can uh, uh, now you can just uh, see what Thor's tier 3 skill does which is probably one of the worst tier 3s in the game <laughs> i hope they fix it i hope they fix the damage please just fix it now uh, because we need it especially in terms of score not world Wars ultimate yes he can just uh, uh definitely do some really good hits against ebony Mo, but that's it i th that's it i guess yeah 
so please just improve it net marble so new mystic uh, new character uh, mystic can be acquired as a crystal wall character for 2500 crystals that's without the sale so on sale it will be i think around 1785 or 1750 crystals for the pack for six star mystic so that's again crystals and then we have danger room a special training reward just like rachel summers and naga sonic we have professor x here for 4500 crystals which will give you 1250 crystals back so that's around 3300 crystals right there so and also uh do, 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 do. let's go down 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 uniform collections then we got a cdp a fixed cdp so the mileage timer or the pity timer on the cdp chest will be there so for for people for players like me or maybe some other people i have three rages so i need more rages so at least even if I spend 7,400 or 7,500 crystals buying 11 chests, it will not, not be a waste because I have spent tons of crystals getting nothing. So at least you will get, if you buy the 10x chest 10 times, it will uh, increase your gauge to 100% and then when it increases to 100% on the 11th pull, it is guaranteed to give you a CDP that you need. It's amazing. At least the CDB that is the chance up right there because I mostly hunt for rage than inside. So that's that's going to be really amazing for me. So just ah, saving crystals, save crystals. Now we have here also if you get the chance to increase CDB again, the pretty timer actually resets. So yeah, that makes sense. Then we have six star ISO and awakened ISO chest for crystals. Yeah, for ISO grinders, it's good. Now for ABX, an improvement has been made so that the total damage per hit is reflected in the score. If it exceed, even if it exceeds a certain value in Alliance Battle Ultimate, which should be Alliance Battle Extreme. Good job, Nat Marvel. Again. <laughs> so here we go. Uh, let me let me just summarize this. So, uh, just to take an example of my Captain Marvel. So, just let's just suppose that my fifth skill, uh, like, uh, let's just say my fifth skill from Captain Marvel has like 10 hits or 15 hits. Let's just take 15 hits and each hit does 1000 damage to the beast. Now, they should have or they must have some limit set for the maximum damage dealt versus and also the maximum points scored per hit for the alliance battle extreme mode right now in the game so let's just say the the limit for the score is 800 so when i do thousand damage per hit from my fifth skill it is only gonna count 800 points or 800 score towards my towards my overall alliance battle score it's only gonna give me 800 and the 200 is just a waste because it's over the limited cap. It will not be applied to the score. Now, after the update, if I'm doing 1000 damage and even if the uh, limit of the damage per hit is 800, if I do 1000 damage, the whole 1000 damage will be added to your score. So in theory, I'm getting 200 damage per hit increase for my score. It, what it can mean that we are going to be scoring more in extreme alliance battle and that actually could be a really good way to counter the 90% damage reduction from the beast roar for characters that cannot actually cancel the roar which is definitely really good yeah definitely i would love to make some more points with my namor i would love to make some more points uh, with my what uh, dr octopus yeah definitely why not it's really good uh one of the mage uh main things that i actually like about this update it's really good and then we have some preparation events then every time you go to the shop it's gonna give you 10 uh, group biometrics but it says you will now receive 10 group, group biometrics free during the tutorial on how to use the st uh, store so it probably as it uh, writes down and if i understand it correctly it's only a one-time thing so you cannot get it like every day. I think it's, it's just going to be free for the first time you enter the Dimension Machine shop for the bio. So yeah, it could be work. And then camera view for Timeline Battle st stage map has been updated. So we can probably have more fun watching our characters play. So biometrics for A4's uh, heroes like She-Hulk, Singularity and Sister Game have been included in the regular selectors. That's actually pretty good to farm those characters because those farm, especially She-Hulk, 
is one of the best leadership for most of the uh, characters now definitely she has been improved or she has been replaced by some of the characters but she is amazing still like for the speed like for the sorry the combat female day for uh, our minerva and probably some other days as well if you don't have the other characters now and we have potential and then stick it and type and then stick it buttons have been added so it's just the button so they will add the potential and then tickets and type enhancing tickets later in the update which will really be helpful because we won't have to spend tons of uh, type enhanced materials like the universal ones to get trying to get thanos to type 6 and feel like what 30 times 50 times and that get frustrated about that so i will be really happy i hope it's not impossible to get them when they introduce to the game and this is actually all for this uh, uh, update definitely the incorrectly dif display text in the alliance battle schedule yeah the korean letters the chinese letters that i can write i cannot actually read it it has been fixed let's know so let that was all for the patch note so let's just go for the crystals cost of this update the the thing that people the most people are actually panicking about the update because it's so expensive like what around 11,000 uh, crystals needed to get everything from the update now let's just go so 2500 crystals for sorry 4500 so that's 3300 crystals for professor x and then we have 2500 for mystic and then we have four new uniforms so that makes around probably around 11000 crystals in total if you get everything now to sort this thing out i mean i'm i just gotta ask you guys something i don't know if you guys feel about feel bad about this or good i don't know how you're gonna uh, i mean react to my what i'm what i'm gonna say there's a difference between what you want and what you need so i think for some of these updates i know the virus the coronavirus thing is going on around the globe and it actually have been has been affecting a lot of players and their spending as well so and also they are having some medicine issues and medical setups definitely i can definitely i mean completely understand that now for this update if you think that this update is gonna be affected by that netmarble is not gonna change anything so what you can do for this update to change for yourself is just pick what you need not just what you want i want every single thing from this update can i get every single thing no why because i have limited resources and if i have limited resources i should spend them well i should think about it i should just take notes of what i actually actually need and what stuff to pick that will actually help my gameplay in a major way than just small than just picking up small uh, pieces of rocks that can that i can uh, use to make up a building i get to get i got to get got the i got to get the pillars first to to set the base for that and i can actually start picking up the rocks after that so what you actually do jean gray one of the most op characters in the game is it is she gonna make a higher or major impact in your game definitely for pvp possibly abx to uh, replace captain marvel pick up that uniform i am gonna pick up that uniform do you actually need nimrod no for what you need an extra character just that you don't even need nimrod he's not gonna be a pve meta he's not gonna be a pvp meta except for mutants mutant stages because he's gonna be better sentinel now except apart from that and what you can actually do just pick up gene uniform pick up mystic one of the most valued character in the game after the update because the buff that she gives to other characters in pvp and pve it's gonna help you a lot that's support character for abx for speed villain day and female villain day for 40 percent damage increase to villain types and then for ac or maybe a pvp content like probably not at but ac it's gonna give you a 45 percent damage increase to superhero types pick up that character the most valuable character in this update probably second best after jean gray because jean gray is going to be probably the best character to spend your crystals on this update so just get jean gray and mystic that's what i'm getting after that do you actually need professor x no what is he going to do for you a new or an extra ac character that you want to spend materials to get to tier 3 just for ac is he going to be a at meta no i don't think so because i think probably 
I mean, before getting uh, to the tier 3 skill, he's gonna die in the hands of Thanos and Jean Grey. And mostly, one of those characters are never banned. It rarely happens when Jean, Jean Grey and Thanos are banned uh, both in uh, 80. Only happens like 1 in one in 10 or 1 in 20. So he's not gonna be your meta anywhere. For World Boss Ultimate, we already have them. He's just gonna be an extra character for now. He's not gonna replace Cable potentially because Cable is so damn strong. He can score, his scores go from 4.5 million to 7 million and above with a CTP of energy with insight on Cable. Why you? I mean, why do you even need Professor X? So that's just, just 3300 crystals that you just saved and 1050 for Sentinel uniform Nimrod. That's a 4300 plus crystal saved for you this update. Wolverine, if you have the X4 uniform, do you even re need this uniform for PvP? Okay, let's just just pick up the uniform. So how much? Jean Grey 1500 and then 2500 for uh, Mystic. That's that makes it four four thousand and then pick up the Wolverine uniform. Five thousand crystals done. The update is done. Magneto. I don't think that he's gonna uh, outscore Captain America for the blast villain day and even if he does is he gonna make a massive difference in your scores i highly doubt i don't think so i don't know why people are getting hyped about the crystal court of this update if i talk about myself i am a abx lover i am a pv pv content lover i'm gonna pick up mystic for 2500 crystals possibly give her a mega tier to ticket that i got a f got for free from the event few day few weeks back i'm gonna pick jean gray that makes it 4,000 crystals for me. Then I'm just gonna wait. Try and learn to wait. You cannot just get everything on the day one as you want. If you wanna maximize your uh, output from what you put in the game, you gotta wait, you gotta have patience. Just have patience and see if Magneto replaces if you are ABX guy. And have patience um, to collect more crystals and get the Nimrod or Magneto uniform next sale. It's not gonna make you amazingly high score in ABX just for one day. It's not gonna make that much difference. So just try to minimize your crystal spend. Wait for uh, and maybe next sale and just pick up the things that you actually need ASAP in this game. Just like Jean Grey uniform, probably Mystic. These two are the main focus of this update. Yeah, right? You just saved like what? 7,000 or probably 6,000 crystals for you. Done. You don't even need to get anything. And the things that you need actually, if you want to get everything else, just wait for the next sale. They gave, ev they gave a new sale every like, three, every like three weeks or more, right? So you can you do that way. Just, just be patient. You will get the crystals. You will get everything else. Just be patient, minimize your, maximize your, sorry, minimize your resource spend, maximize your output from the resources that you spend, and you are happy. You're good to go. So I'm not, it's it's already been like 18 minutes, 19 minutes video. Sorry for the big speech. But thank you so much for listening to me if you are still watching this video. So just let me know what you think about the video. Let me know what you think about my thoughts about how to minimize and maximize your uh, crystal spending for this update and the updates coming uh, after this. And just definitely stay safe from the coronavirus, guys. And stay safe and try not to get in the crowdy people, crowdy area. So just let me know what you think about the video and let me know what your thoughts are on my thoughts for this patch notes. And if you like or if you if I said something wrong or if uh, if you think if you support me, just let me know in the comments. And as always, if you like the content, I hope to see you again. Take care. See ya. Have fun with it.